welcome this is the energy vibration reading for you is scorpion sun moon and rising signs thank you for being here thank you for being back this is a wonderful week it is the third week of august 2017 and the energy of this third week is the energy of fire the week begins from the 14 until the 20 whatever is happening in this week it's going to be a cleansing it is going to be a cleansing some thing that was hidden is going to come out in the light it's going to be a cleansing this week is the energy of the tower your water sign and the energy of the tower bring the zodiac energy of fire so whatever is happening especially to you young um, scorpion it's the mystery is going to come out whatever is happening if you have a situation with a queen of swords if you have a relationship if you are someone who have a relationship with someone who is a Libran a Gemini or an Aquarius the whatever is coming out it's going to come out whatever lies that she has done whatever she has done it's going to come out okay so this is going to be good because the Sun the energy of the Sun and whenever the energy of the Sun and for the people who wants to know what deck am I using I am using the deck of the orbits I'm using the deck of the orbits okay whatever the situation is of was whatever this situation is with this um, Queen because she's the only um, person that is in this reading so you scorpions who are having a situation a relationship with an, an an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra you need to understand something something is going to come out the Sun is coming in this week the Sun is crowning your reading and it's coming in this week to bring out information to you whatever this person what doing is going to come out in this week a sense of growth and harmony feeling of self-worth gaining recognition so for some people you're going to be gaining recognition feeling as if you know self-worth gaining recognition whatever it was a sense of growth this is saying that you have arrived and now bashed in the sunlight of recognition in a love aspect it is says you accept yourself and your beloved ones without trying to change he or she it is an excellent omen for future happiness so whatever is happening it's going to be good secrets are going to be coming out secrets whoever has been keeping secret against you or from you secrets are going to come out you scorpion be ready because the wheel of fortune is bringing this out whatever lies where your intuition you're going to see this so it is it has to do with the queen whoever the Aries the Leo or the Gemini the Aries the um, Gemini or the Libra is it's going to be coming out in this week let's look and see what other messages you have because you have a lot of major arcana Man, a lot of major arcanas, a lot of major arcanas, a lot of major arcanas, okay? A lot of major arcanas are here. A lot of major arcanas are here, okay? As I'm looking at your week, five, justice, oh, wow, wow okay remember I said that the energy of the Sun a lot of secrets are going to be coming out justice is here with the energy of the Sun that is crowned in your week you scorpions whatever is happen the Sun energy bring justice so I told you guys whatever secrets were there are going to be coming out because justice the Sun is bringing out the energy of justice so whatever this 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 um, this woman and she's there on Thursday and I am I'm, I'm saying something Thursday is playing a significant role in this week where it's releasing what you no longer need and I have been seeing this energy with this uh, this woman a nine justice is going to be prevail so your number your, your your number energy is five and five and fifty five uh, five and fifty five is uh, a nine 
five fifty five and nine. 5, 55, and 9. So you have 5, 9, 55, 9, and 9. End of something coming in your life. Tr um, tr um, tr um, transformation coming in your life. So this is going to be good. So, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, whatever the situation that was happening, whatever lies that has been kept, it's coming out to light. This is what is going to be the energy of this week. And it's going to be for the page of cups so if you're between the ages of 0 to 5 and 35 it's going to be a week for you that whoever this queen it could be a mom whatever lies this queen of sword dead it's going to come out in the light if it was your partner let her go if it's your mother heal the situation whoever this queen of swords is release her Call the universal angels in to release her. Whoever this person is needs to leave your life. If it's your mother, heal the situation. If your father, heal the situation. But if it is a relationship that you have been in, release this person from your life. Let's look at what is happening. The energy of judgment comes in. It is going to be a week of judgment, ladies and gentlemen, because secrets are going to be coming out. Whatever the situation is, judgment is coming in. Whoever this person is, if you know someone between the ages of 0, 18 and 35, 18 and 35, this is a Taurus, a Virgo or a Capricorn. There, he is going to bring and let you know something a secret he is going to bring the state of judgment in your life letting you know of something and opening up a door that you weren't aware of things that you weren't aware of this is going to be good this person this knight of coins is actually helping you that's really good Tuesday is a wonderful day it's your day Tuesday is your day Tuesday Wednesday is your day whatever is happening Tuesday and Wednesday is your day the energy of the moon comes out you work with the energy of the moon because you bring out all the lies so if someone was stealing from you you're going to see that because you're going to you're going to start thinking for yourself it's as if an energy an alien came in and this is about the queen of swords so if you have a relationship whoever this queen of swords whoever this aquarius gemini or libra person is in your life you are going to see that all it was about is money all it was about is money because you're looking at a situation you're looking at the situation of this person because she's right over you so i know exactly who you're thinking about it was all about the money it was all about the money release this person from your life whoever you are you scorpions you know release this person the Sun comes up which is the uh, crowning of your week and with justice so whatever lies this person was telling because you are sitting down and you're thinking you're going with your intuition you're listening to your intuition and it is about the Queen of a uh, sword whoever the screen of sword the the the, 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 the truth is going to come out whatever lies the truth is going to come out for the rest of the people who have a legal uh, suit uh, whatever lawsuit you have you're going to win you're going to win and you're going to win big whatever legal situation whatever lawsuit you're going to win and you're going to win big you're going to win and you're going to win big as we go forward and we're looking at the situation we have the queen of swords this is an um, an Aquarius, a Gemini of a Leo, of a, 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 um, a Libra, and strength. You need to have strength against her. It's as if you want to get rid of this person and she won't leave you. You know, in the sense of a relationship, it's as if you 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 want to get rid of her, but she won't leave you. Okay, and you need to release her. Whatever the situation is, you need to release her. It's as if. This person is clinging on to you and you need to crowbar, use a crowbar and get rid of her. And how you're going to do that is call up on the universal angels. Ask the universal angels to release you from this person. Release this person, the hold that this person has on you. Okay? 
for the rest if you have a situation with your mom and your mom is an Aries a Gemini or a Libra you need to take in consideration to have love love use love as the basis of the situation uh, if it's someone at your work but whatever the situation is it has is a personal situation a personal is a journey a personal journey because it's as if you met someone else and this person is totally different from this person and you're thinking why were, was I with this person? How could I be with this person? And you're thinking something isn't right here. You go within. And when you go within, you realize that it's all about the money. You need to get rid of this person, whoever this person is. As we look at Friday, we have the Three of Pentacles, whatever the energy of the Three of Pentacles is. Um, you have the energy of the Nine of Swords. So you need not worry about your money. It's as if this person stole from you. Whatever she stole me uh, mentally and physical, emotionally, mentally, and physical from you is something about something that you're trying to build, but it's a lie. You were building something on a lie, and now you're seeing it. Whatever you are trying to build with this person, you're building something on a lie, and now you're seeing it. Okay, get rid of this person, get rid of her. As we go forward, we have the energy of the devil. Uh, the energy of the ten of ones and it is now in reverse so whatever the ten of ones energy of the ten of ones and it is in reverse whatever burden you have it is now in reverse and you're happily trying to move away from whatever the situation is so it's as if you know you're moving towards someone who is um, a Leo a Sagittarius or a or a um, Aries person so whatever the ten of ones is you're moving because I saw this person came up in your reading last week too that you have met someone who was an Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius you have met someone that is a, a Leo Aries or a Sagittarius and you are realizing that the person the queen of sword that you were with the Aries and Gemini's and Libra was not the right person you were realizing that she was only there for the money so now you've met this person and you get rid of get, getting rid of the the um the queen of of swords. So you're going to go with the Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius person, whoever this person is. You are feeling much connected to this person. Whatever lies that the queen of sword, she's out. As we go forward, we have the nine of cups. Your wishes and dreams are coming true. Thank you. Thanks to the universal angels and the guides and the guiding angels of the scorpions because whatever the situation was, you are your wishes and dreams are going to come true. And your wishes of dreams are going to come true. And you have the energy of the king of pentacles. This could be a connection with your father and mother because this the, the queen of swords was getting between the connection between your father and mother you realize that your mother or father did not like this person for whatever reason and sometimes that you are in relationships and your parents are not you know connecting with um, a person is because they're seeing um, they're seeing things about that person that you're not seeing because you're in the relationship or you're all in love and either your mother or father saw that this person was not the person for you and you are really seeing it and your wishes a dream you are really connecting with your mom you want to connect with your mom or your father and this is going to happen for you um, the nine of cups it's going to happen for you so whatever the situation is um, it's going to come out to be a very very extremely good situation because your wishes and dream so the energy of the Sun is over coupling your 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 weak justice um, secrets that was there you're seeing for yourself because you have the energy of the moon on Tuesday you were thinking you're thinking and you realize something about the queen of swords who is uh, your partner okay and it's not it's not people who are married um, if you're in a relationship it's not going to affect if you're in a relationship and you're married it's not going to affect you because I never speak about the married people in my readings because if when you're married you try to work out whatever situation that is going on but for you Scorpio what is happening there is the Sun with justice is lies and whatever the lies and whatever that has been playing behind your back is coming out and for people who you know I am um, people um, other people can um, hold you in bondage 
it's as if you're in a relationship all of a sudden you meet this person you're uh, in ends in a relationship and you're not aware of why and now you start to think about it and you have met someone last week because I saw that in your reading go back to your reading last week you scorpions because you have met someone last week who is an Aries uh, who have been an Aries um, Aries um, um, Leo or a Sagittarius you have met someone last week who was a Aries Leo or Sagittarius and that person came back in your um, came back in your reading because you're realizing that this person you you know this person is different than the person that you're with okay and the person who you're with this Aquarius Libra or Gemini is all there for the money you need strength to release yourself take a core bar and release yourself from this person ask the universal angel because something happened and you realize that this person is a much better person you realize that this Queen of Swords your parents was liking this Queen of Swords but you were doing it you know because you and then you realize that either your mother or father is not and you want to have a, a good relationship with your parents because there is the love the love between a parents nobody else can ever come between and should ever come between the love between you and a parents and somehow this queen of swords was coming between you and your parents and you found someone else who is a Harry's a Leo or a Sagittarius and this person is a good person for you and you're seeing that and you now start to question yourself about the queen of sword and you're questioning yourself and you're seeing that that was not a good person that was not it was all about the money and you can see it here so you're not even going to worry about that anymore so it's going to work out so whoever these are for you know this is a page of love so new love is coming in your life for you scorpion whatever is happening new love is coming in your life wonderful positive new love is coming into your life as i look at your week you have judgment so the night and a taurus virgo or capricorn is going to come in your life to show you something about a situation in your life and whatever the situation is you have whatever the worries and you know whatever that was keeping you down keeping you back you're going to be releasing it you're going to be releasing it and connect with someone who is a, a Aries a Leo or a um, Sagittarius so what is happening is that this the first part of the week is that you're going to start thinking you're going to start thinking about your money or you're going to start thinking because you realize that there is something that isn't correct you're going to start thinking about this Queen of Sword that it's not the right person. You need to find inner strength to deal with her, to remove her out of your life. Second half of the week is that you're going to find the strength to remove her out of your life. And uh, the worries about you connecting with other people, you're not going to worry about that anymore because whatever it is, this Queen of Sword was trying to keep you away from the relationship between your mother and your father because it is the energy of vibration of a king or a queen so it's your mother and your father that there was something that was happening that this queen of sword was trying to keep you away from that relationship to connect with your mother and your father and you are going to see that the universal energies is coming going to come and move her out because you're going to find out that she did something that was illegal so the secret that she had is going to come out and this is going to be good so whoever this night of of, of, of uh, Knight of Pentacles is Knight of Coins. He is going to bring you that information and let you know what this Queen of Sword did. And I'm, 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 I, I became silent because the the facts went off. So it's true. It's true. <laughs> So the universe always give me a sign when you know, especially when I'm doing my readings and that sort of a thing. And I'm, yes, it's true. So whatever justice, you're going to find out what this Queen of Sword did because it's like this. It's, it's, it's as if this woman that you had as your relationship with a woman or a man, he did something against your mother and father. Whatever it was, 
it's going to come out because and somehow this another pentacle person the knight of pentacles the, the capricorn the virgo or the taurus that man is going to come and it's a, as if this man is going to say something and wake you up to something and you're going to start thinking and then you, and then you need to get rid of this person whatever she did was something illegal against either your mother or father and it's going to come out in the light justice is going to prevail and you're going to know about it and you're going to get rid of her because she was in your life for only money so it's as if she stole something for your mother your father has whatever it was whatever and they are going to say you know this person is not a good person because i came there and she took something and she really did take it whatever she did she did it okay whatever this person did she did it because there is a sun and justice and that means that whatever Whatever that happened you are going to start thinking for yourself now you're going to really start thinking for yourself now and you're going to realize that she was only there for the money she stole something and sell it something she did is going to come to light and you're going to finally get rid of her get rid of her I'm sorry people because this Queen of Sword you had no reason to be with this Queen of Sword whoever you are you had no reason to be with this Queen of Sword this person is vibrating on such a low energy vibration and you need whenever you get rid of her you will find your sacral chakra you need to find your sacral chakra yield your sacral chakra so you can get rid of her because whatever she did she's trying to put her old on you and finally somebody opened your eyes the sacred chakra is the energy of orange so in this week call upon Archangel Metatron to place the orange coat of protection it's an orange week so you need to find find back your inner power you need to find back your inner power the color of orange from from water drink a lot of water this is going to help has to do with the testicles and the ovaries okay and I want I want to get rid of this person I need to get rid of this person whoever she is whoever whatever energies of demon or whatever send her in my life get rid of her I'm sorry people because you know I have kids too and I can understand that sometimes there's a situation that people come between their kids and the people come between their kids and uh, and, their, and the parents and this is something that is not supposed to happen okay you cannot come in a relationship with someone and you don't like the parents that means move away and it's not really of not liking the parents this person stole something from one of the parents so it could be someone um, who stole something from you, you you took them to your parents house and they stole something and you're in conflict now with your with your parents but it's not really conflict because your parents know that you didn't do it they did you know it's as if the information comes out and the, the parents know that you didn't do it they did it so whatever it was it's going to happen it's going to come out justice is going to prevail get rid of her find the inner strength ask the universal angel for to heal your sacred chakra and find the inner strength and get rid of this person okay they did steal something of your parents I got your back so whatever it is your parents are saying to you I got your back whatever situation that has happened I got your back your parents really truly believe in you and know that you did not do it and they have your back okay listen um, ladies and gentlemen boys and girls your parents it doesn't really matter what you can do to your parents the love that your parents have for you your parents know who you are as a child so even when people come and lying to your parents about you they know who you are your parents always got your back you can split in the uh, spit in the face of fear spit um, and flip off those bars on the door shake your fist to anyone who dare to say no because you sweet thing are divinely protected by the dude the dude is God whoever you call him the creator the source of all thing yeah um, again always and forever amen so whoever you are whoever you are out there you can spit in the face of fear flip off those who bear who bury the, who bar, bury the doors shake your fists to anyone who dares to say no 
because you sweet thing are divinely protected by the dude of the most I always and forever amen I am praying for whoever out there that is and I'm asking the dude <laughs> to come in and release whoever is sitting in a relationship that someone has been manipulating you for a very long time I have been seeing this coming up in readings and readings and readings you um, 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 Scorpius do not understand you have to go with uh, um, either someone of your own element or a fire person never ever go with the hair people okay not all of you can deal with relationships with the air people because they are manipulative people and your water you will form and take the shape of their manipulation and let them manipulate you all the time so remember your parents got your back the dude um I got your back whoever you see the dude um I as is, 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 is the angels and guides and your universal angels you're protected you're divinely protected whoever you are out there watching this video know that you are protected you're divinely protected and your angels and guides and the dude um I they have your back okay so whatever the situation is that's why people can let things go on and go on lies always come out people I always tell people I have no time to lie because guess what the lies are always coming out um, the last this is this is powerful because I have a child that is also um, you know and 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 and, and this is uh, you know the situation with these uh, I, you know I have nothing against certain people but certain people and certain relationship and sometimes you can't get involved in your children relationships uh, and whatever happened between your child whoever you are out there do not have and thing there with your parents because uh, they love you they know who you are they know that you would never do anything to hurt them you know um, whoever that is normal and in, in balance will never do anything to hurt their parents okay and whoever this this Queen of Sword was she is really a piece of work and if this this is either Queen of Sword or um, the King of Sword is really really a piece of work because this is obviously someone between the ages so this reading has to do with it for um, parents and their child someone you brought someone over or there is a connection between you and a relationship that you're having with a, a um, somebody who is a Aries a Libra or a Virgo and they came and they did something to your parents they did something to one of your parents or to both of your parents whatever they did she did something get rid of her I'm asking the angels and guides and the angels to release me from this energy because I know I have a child and I don't want anyone to ever do anything to my child because I I have never done anything my child is always you know vibrating on the high energy vibration as myself he's always hard working and that sort of a thing and you know women can or men can also be so brutal because water people they're very loving people you know all they have is love and all they want to give is love and sometimes there are people who just use their energy vibration to manipulate them and the swords people or people who are known to manipulate situation in whatever way they want to get a situation and obviously this child has been um, being manipulated I'm asking the angel what message do you have to give look for a sign look for a sign okay I'm so look for a sign okay so ladies and gentlemen boys and girl whatever the situation is look for a sign because it's going to look for a sign because the angels are helping you within the situation so whatever your your messages whatever your question was look for a sign because it's going to happen I won't go any further with this reading because um, it's, it's, it's you know it's it, it can break my heart um, what people do to each other and that you can just go in a relationship for money or whatever the situation just for money to steal things and that sort of a things be aware of what is happening around us and um, know that love is the only thing that is real please go back and listen to your monthly reading because there's information in your monthly reading that is going to help you this is the third week so there's um, two more weeks to go 
so listen to the two the other two weeks of the reading i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back and i'm saying namaste until next week